then I'm going to come along and try to teach you things. Doesn't make him any smarter. You just go on and do whatever you feel like. Legend has it that Captain Cook was often absent of an evening. <laughs> the crew suspected he might have a mistress. Incredible. This was uh, one of the most spot on kind of trailer parodies I've ever seen. I was actually in awe of how good it was from the the text and the phone Netflix title cards coming through to the kind of zany quality of a lot of uh, indie romance movies where the characters are slightly unwell but still quirky still cute um and kind of hints of the queen's gambit in it as well so so funny uh really creative visuals to it throughout um great pacing and uh the humor was just spot on and specific as possible throughout um i want to see this as a feature make it happen for me this is a funny quirky short we follow the exploits of a Connect Four lover. So many humorous scenes of the lead playing Connect Four to excess. The lead performer really has strong comedic skills. I like the colorful wardrobe of all the characters and the catchy soundtrack, notably the accordion. My favorite scene is when the adult lead is kicked out for trying to join a kids Connect Four tourney. I laughed out loud. Well, this was a comedic, quick film. Uh, it seems to be of a woman who's on her way and trying to find her Connect Four game tournament. And I think what we're seeing is the things that are going through her mind. And there's characters telling her what to do and directing her. Um, it's full of color pops and bizarre characters that make it appealing. Um, I think one of the takeaways is that this lady misses her childhood of games and candy and being free to do what you want. And I think the lead actress had the right expression quality for this bright and full of life and just funny. Concept was just so bizarre that uh, <laughs> you 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 can't help but just get it glued to the screen. Um, essentially, watching the story of this thirty-plus-year-old woman, uh, essentially in one of those kind of sports uh, movies, but it's more about just a Connect Four tournament, trying to win this Connect Four tournament. Um, the entire concept was very bizarre. Uh, but in a humorous way, uh, you definitely have a lot of fun watching it. Just wondering just the sheer absur absurdity of if this were to be a feature length film of just trying to win a children's game. All the characters are extremely memorable, extremely unique. Um, the small hands, such a comedic device that we have all come to love at this point. Um, who doesn't like a small hand? It really takes me back to, you know, certain um, SNL um, skits and things like that that just kind of come to mind when I think of that device. And it reads like it's a trailer of a series that I definitely want to watch. And one constant thing that we saw throughout was her infatuation with Connect Four. And then we get the sense, oh, okay, she plays professionally. We get the sense that this is a romantic comedy with a little bit of a absur absurdity wrapped up in it. We get the sense that there's some darkness in it, you know, as far as her um, uh, abuse of substances and just that she's not all the way there. Um, she's not all the way stable, <laughs> but yeah, I did like how they turned this into sort of a trailer for you know, Netflix series as they called it. Um, and it did give me a sense of like, huh, I kind of want to watch this show. I've only seen one episode of The Queen's Gambit, but I felt like this was almost like a spoof on that to some degree, because that was about chess. This is about Connect Four, um, The Captain's Mistress, The Queen's Gambit. I don't know. It just had some similarities. I only saw one episode, so I'm not sure if that was the point, but it was fun. Um, 
the girl character, the child with the little hands. Uh, that cracked me up and was very creative. Just fun, nice music, good performances, and it set me up to want more. So if you make it a feature, I'm an audience member already. I um, kind of want to see where this goes. I thought it was interesting how um, it presented as a trailer and sort of played out like that throughout the short. I, I think that was like a very um, creative idea from the filmmaker to do that. Um, I like the uh, touches of comedy implemented in this um, and kind of absurd absurdism as well that they introduced in the film, like the strange props and the sort of wild costumes and makeup. I think that was um, a very fun introduction. Um, I think the main character presents herself as this sort of kind of hot mess, hopeless romantic sort of girl, um, which I thought that, um, which is a very endearing sort of character and I think the filmmaker did well to do that. 